Hi everybody. In this video, I am going to solve the banker deadlock avoidance algorithm. Here there is a problem. A system shared nine tape drives. The current allocation and maximum requirement of tape drive is given below. Process current allocation maximum. Total uh, tape is uh, total tape total tape equal to nine. Here uh, available used currently use tape equal to 3 plus 1 plus 3 that is equal to 7 so available equal to 9 minus 7 that is equal to 2 so there are two number of uh, tape drives are available in the system need equal to max minus allocation that is equal to p1 p2 p3 uh, need for P1 is four, 7 minus 3 equal to 4. Need for P2 is 5. Need for P3 is 2. That is max minus allocation. Now we need to check every process. I equal to 1. Uh, we need to check need less than equal to work. Here work equal to available. Work is a variable which is used to store the current available value. We need to check need less than equal to available. Here, uh, need less than equal to, that is 4 less than equal to available, no. So, we need to check next one, idle 2. Need 5 less than equal to available, no. Then, for I equal to 3, 2 less than equal to 2, yes. That means, work is updated. Work equal to work plus allocation, that is 2 plus allocation is 3. 2 plus 3 equal to 5. Now, that is safe, that is P3 is safe. Now, when I equal to 1 again, then we need to check need 4 and available is work is 5. Yes, that is work equal to work plus allocation. Work is 5. Allocation of P1 is 3. That is equal to 8. And now P3 and next one is P1 is safe. Now, I equal to 2. Your work is uh, need need is uh, five and available work is eight five less than eight yes now work is eight plus one that is equal to nine now all tape drive are released and the sequence is p3 p1 and p2 and they are safe so thank you very much for watching this video share and subscribe it thank you.